So, my camera broke and I am doing a photo shoot in four hours. So, yay. <laughs> showing you guys so repairing this camera is quite expensive and I will not get it back in three hours <laughs> Emily said it's fine I could just use my phone to take pictures of her and man I, I really hate that it's a metric day and it's quite special it's something you will remember but we're gonna figure out how to deal with this and we're gonna start by I feel so lucky I met you and I still um, can't believe that I get to see those eyes from more than tonight. I was stressed out and honestly, I panicked a little. The idea of taking photos on a phone, especially on a special day like this, made me nervous. I felt like I let Emily down. I know this was out of my control, but I really wanted to help. I knew if I was going to take pictures on my phone, that would affect my confidence and that would make the whole photo shoot uncomfortable. And not to mention, how bad the quality might look of the pictures. And that's why I decided just to get out of the house, to clear my head and just to think what's my next move. Guys, so I'm here at the Missy. Not really sure what the plan is. I might take a few lessons by Lucian, but who knows? Who knows? I just might just chill here. Uh, I'm basically just vlogging out, just to um, get over my get over my fear of vlogging in front of people. You know, because here, here are like people. But yeah, I'm chilled. I'm chilled. Not nervous at all. Relax. Um, I feel like I can kind of get used to this feeling. You know. <laughs> so I'm home now and um, I decided that I'm just gonna wear a bit semi-formal type of clothes because I just don't want to go shoot um, in this casual way <laughs> so yeah like I said in my previous video dress how you want to be addressed that's not something that I was just saying to sound smart or cool that's actually something I love by right, so we did it we did it not really a foot but yeah we did it I mean it, it's extremely hot but this is the type of sacrifices you have to make it's all about the image I'm doing a vlog on my phone. <laughs> What's up, my man? Oh, good, oh, good. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Mm -hmm. ah. <laughs> oh, good. I'll check it out now. Right, so. Yeah, no, no, that was all part of the plan. That was all part of the plan. Stop your Who's good to be that thing? It does. Your favorite character. <laughs> favorite side character, please. Look, at this point, I'm like the main <laughs> character. Yeah, I am the favorite one. I am the thing that people come back for. Okay. Alright, so yeah. Yeah, that's all I have to say. thing about me when it comes to swimming in a pool or the ocean I do not feel the water I just run straight into it I just dive head in <laughs> 
As a young kid I used to cry a lot and not because I was naughty but more because I was afraid. Afraid of interacting with people that wasn't my parents. And up until grade 8 I used to be scared of a lot of things. Talking to girls out of my league, talking to people who are smarter than me, scared to take opportunities, just scared of everything. I was paralyzed by the fear of looking dumb or being perceived as a joke. I made a mental switch, a conscious choice to no longer be a captive of my own fears. I decided that I would no longer be afraid to dive into the pool without knowing the water's temperature, to confront people I've been avoiding, and most importantly, to embrace the possibility of looking dumb or being a joke. I realized I didn't have to be perfect, that it was okay to be vulnerable, to make mistakes, to just be me. While I was at the driving range, it came to me that Liam has a camera and without hesitation, he offered to help. When it comes to stressful situations, I've learned to put my emotions aside and just act. So here's my take on things. Don't let stress overwhelm you. Realize that you are in control. Put your emotions aside and just try to act on the problem, act on the situation. And um, here's a bucket coming, but I won't stop because I'm in control of the situation. Um, yeah, that's it. <laughs> um, <laughs> But yeah, um, see I handled it guys, I just handled the situation, I was kind of in a mood to stress but I just realized, nah, I'm, I'm gonna stand my ground and then just face the awkwardness. Learn to realize that money doesn't always solve problems and um, sometimes it's about the people, their willingness to help, the cost that matters. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll keep on recording, even if it's not my camera. And remember, I believe in you.